I type in bookshelf and I see the two things and I'm like, okay, one seller is Kathy, the other is Morgan. I send them both the same text message. Hello, I saw your bookshelf on Gumtree. Is it still available? Kathy texts back straight away saying, sorry, it went this morning. <laughs> That's cool, Kathy. I'm sorry I gave you an annoying voice in the retelling of this story. <laughs> Morgan's response came through a couple of minutes later and simply read, It was my wife's bookshelf. <laughs> How do you respond to that? Aside from the fact that it doesn't answer my fucking question, his use of past tense in that sentence unnerved me slightly. I'm like, oh, I should probably just find another bookshelf. And then I noticed he lived in the suburb next to me, so I replied, is it still available? <laughs> he responded with the letter Y. Just a Y? Is he asking me why I want to know if it's still available? Or is it a Y for yes? And he's so in the throes of grief that he can't manage the E and the S. <laughs> I assume it's a Y for yes, so I respond, cool, I'll take it. When's a good time to come and pick it up? No reply for 15 minutes. I'm like, oh, he's forgotten about me. Fuck it, I'll find another bookshelf. And then when his reply actually does come through, I realise he spent those 15 minutes crafting his response because it's a fucking thesis. <laughs> he must have felt so bad about only using a single consonant in his previous text that he just massively overcompensated with this one. <laughs> also, for some reason, felt that the use of punctuation entirely unnecessary. <laughs> so it's just one obscenely long sentence which reads, you must come and pick up now. I only have short time here at house and also it wide. So bring van or trailer and their stair, but I can help you carry downstairs. If you come park out front, walk up past ring bell and I will help you carry it to trailer or van. I only accept cash. And if you do not come now, I will sell it someone else. <laughs> I should just find another bookshelf at this point. <laughs> but now I am fascinated by Morgan and I simply must meet the man. <laughs>